Good care to me is delivering for people what it is they want and need. You have to satisfy their need, but particularly focusing more on what they want. I think I'm blessed because I have a great provider and they're very good at listening and I'm on their quality control panel, which really helps because then I can give feedback for myself, but also for other people like my sisters. We have a forum every Monday. They're informed as to what's happening and they have the freedom to speak if they have an issue and people feel very comfortable with one another and uh, they often make their remarks. That forum gives you a great deal of freedom of expression and people have that self-value then. They feel, well, you know, I do contribute. And that's really, really important for older people. They're not sort of put aside. A welder means a wise elder. We meet monthly and we discuss things that we think will benefit the home. Part of my job is I welcome new people to the home and I find that that's really, really gratifying. So welders do a lot of work in the home here. If people are worried about things, they come and talk to us. There's a lot of transparency here. I've brought up lots of things that by the next day, they're looking into how to fix what I've mentioned. To give feedback, I think is very important because there's no point in people muttering, oh, you know, such a dreadful, um, nothing will happen about it. I've been encouraged to keep involved. I was um, appointed as a representative of the residents and asked to attend the monthly meeting where we discuss our entire operation. There's just so much to be done if you want to do it. Since I've entered this home here, I think we are, we are changing things. We are pioneers because I had so much input Communication is one of the most important things that you can have. And it involves everything. Cleaners, carers, staff, management, everything. Every staff member I have a great deal of respect for. And that respect is shown to me. It's a two-way street always. Being able to have that uh, choice and being able to exercise that choice to determine uh, how you want to live the life each day. There are always challenges in terms of services and support. I think feedback is the key to making sure the services have continuous improvement. That is so important, leading a satisfactory quality of life and, and feeling comfortable being able to live how you want to live.